Get your own personal unboxing video. Kohan versus the Mutant Mini. First impressions, this is a beauty. Told I did play this a little bit yesterday, but I have not yet plugged them in. Nervous system I got home last night. Definitely the main difference, obviously, is the body size. Uh, let's have a little whiskey. I see what comes of it. Where's my guy here? First things first, actually. I will edit this out, but I got to tune yours. You got this in your drop tuning. Which I guess I can play for you. Two hours later. Sorry, I'm not in perfect tuning, but I'll fix it for the next little bit here. Let me take a pause. All right, well now, now that we're in standard, I think I think it does work well with that drop tuning. Probably use lighter strings, honestly, if you're gonna um, keep them in standard. I think the, the thing about the Cole that's strange to me is it's like they didn't shrink in all dimensions so it still feels in some ways like a full size guitar but um, smaller at the same time. <laughs> First impressions, these unplugged, is the maintenance a little bit more balanced? And the coal has kind of like this scoop thing going for it, where you got a lot of bass and that uh, treble, but.
getting very warm. And obviously, some of this is string difference. My strings are old as shit. They're the Monel. These are obviously new, heavier gauge, so that's gonna give a little bit of that punch, but. strings on it or keep it in that down tune if you're gonna keep it in the <coughs> c tuning yeah these heavy strings are good but it's even with the smaller body i've always found mine a little bit lighter strings than what i usually do for my i think i keep 11s on there 11s or 12s versus like the 13s could be a mistake it's been a while um I mean, first impressions, man, this thing is really nice. It's comfortable. It takes a little getting used to, but, you know, and I didn't, I obviously liked this thing since when I got it, but it took me a while to really break into it, and if I'm honest, this past six, few months, six months, is that when I really started to jive with it. I've always liked it, never wanted to get rid of it, but, like, this last little bit, I've been playing it. Honestly, my hands were tired from work and everything going on. I just wanted to play something a little bit smaller. I'm doing a lot of the finger-picking blues stuff. You know, this just seemed like a nice little blues machine. strings but I feel like this the main seems to ring a little bit and that could be my individual guitar could be this has been in my possession for like three years and broken in a little bit versus a brand new guitar it would just sound like a string ring sure if you're looking to get one of these maintenance but you asked for the review I'm this thing is really nice man but it does have it has like a scoop thing like a lot of bass a lot of high it's probably the body shape It's great. I mean, I think it's just going to take a little bit to figure out um, how to make it sing. Cause it definitely does sing. It resonates nice. I think the one thing I really like about this is the satin finish. I'm a sucker for satin finishes particularly on necks. And ironically, both my guitars have <laughs> glossy necks, which are a little sticky to me. I like the satin, but. This neck, the neck on this is a little more comfortable. I think it's a little bit narrower. And it has this weird, like, like, I don't know if it's bolted in there or something like that, but it's like, a, it's just a cut. But this is almost more like a real, well not real guitar, but like a full size guitar. I guess that's the whole thing with this. It's like, they shrunk it a little bit this way, but didn't really shrink it sideways. 
which gives it like a little bit more of that bassy punch thing. keep it I think you need to fuss around and try a bunch of different strings see which ones really make it which ones really make it sing and then play it a whole bunch give it some breaking time to your your style I'm looking forward to plugging in but acoustically it's pretty nice Could just be because I'm more comfortable with this. I like the tone of this one better. A little bit more balanced and snappy. I think the clarity's there. Two. Plugged in. Cheers. Um, <laughs> Cause I like doing this stuff. You have two audio pickups. Um, one is like a SM57 type thing right in front of my AER. A little bit of reverb. No pedals and nothing else.
as your baby sounds like. just like if you want two pretty similar guitars I haven't played your other one too much but I would imagine this is somewhat like your other coal horn just the, it's whether or not you like this body shape and if this is more comfortable for you scale length is fine for me Better not, I won't 
say, but you know, it's just it is that's just an is situation. Because this is my volume maxed, and it's definitely a little bit quieter without changing any settings. You know. See, there's some <laughs> stuff going through the AER preamping and whatnot. But. Definitely shines plugged in. You were definitely right about that. You know, I know how to kind of sweeten, feel, pull the sweetness out of this thing a little bit better, but I mean, I think it still is kind of the same thing that the Martin, the maintenance, is, the maintenance is a little bit more balanced. with it are the body shape. I mean, they're both really nice guitars. They have that similar... Similar tones. But this is a little bit more balanced. But 
that pickup system is definitely very nice. And uh, yeah. Hope this helps. Mm -hmm.